Hi, this is Fred with Electrek, and today we're going to check out Tesla's FSD Beta, full self-driving beta 10.69.2 update. It's the new update that just got um, pushed out to the entire fleet of 100,000 FSD Beta tester in North America. So come check it out. Here are the release notes. Um, I'm gonna provide a full link in the description if you want to uh, go into deeper dive here because I, I will just glance over them real quick. Uh, so a, a lot of it is about uh, the uh, new deep lane guidance, the vector lanes neural network update. Uh, there's a lot of uh, improved driving smoothness, uh, make it feel more natural and the improved on prototype left turn. So that's has been a big thing throughout uh, the whole testing of the different iteration of 10.69, the old Chuck Cook style on protected left turn. Uh, a lot of effort has been put through that, but this is one of the biggest update overall for the entire FSD beta and a lot of the neural nets that powers it uh, have been updated with this update. Uh, again, a link uh, was gonna provide it in the description, but uh, let's, uh, let's give it a first drive right here. All right, so let's give it a shot. Well, already there's a mistake because it shouldn't be 40 kilometers an hour. The limit here is 50 kilometers an hour. So I'm going to speed it up, see if it detects its mistake. Um, right now we are, um, the road that we're going to take here, we're going to uh, a restaurant in uh, Shawinigan and it's going to take us through some country roads. It's going to be one or two traffic lights. Uh, two or three stop intersections shouldn't be too complicated of a route uh, to navigate actually a pretty simple route um, also very few pedestrians on the route which is uh, especially when it's the first time I'm testing it it's a priority for me uh, there might be some bicyclists though uh, there's a lot of bicyclists on that road we're gonna be careful for that it did switch to 50 kilometers an hour so it does detect now that it's at 50. Always keeps your hands on the steering wheel, ready to take control at all time. bit of a slowdown for that car coming but not too strong felt pretty natural so now we have a right turn coming up and it's kind of hard here to see on the left for cars coming the car is gonna have to creep forward a little bit which is doing right now it's completely clear perfect Ew. Kind of hugged that left lane a little bit too much for me, but uh, it, it felt safe still. So again, it, it's it's a 50 kilometers an hour route, and it goes it, it takes 40 for some reason. I don't, I don't know. There, there's no I, I'm not aware of any 40 kilometers an hour um, speed limit in Quebec. <laughs> I've never seen that. Uh, so it's if now it's switched to 50, so it detected the. Uh, speed the sign there you can drive a little bit more than 50 here it's a it's a country road but let's go to 60 here no one's gonna stop us at 60 and it's pretty safe trust me have a stop and another right turn coming up um, in a kilometer but that's a four-way stop so it should be fairly easy but it would be interesting to see sometimes a lot of people arrive at the same time in the stop to see how the self-driving reacts to that Okay, we have 
much on the side of the road and they're detecting it right now. Not the dark. Oh, they detect the dark too, last minute. Slowing down for the stop. You're hugging the right, kind of going a little bit on the bike lane, which I don't like, but the full stop. Slowly creeping forward. Pretty good, but it did embark it a little bit on the bike lane for another good, no good reason. So now we're entering more of a residential area uh, and there's going to be one or two, uh, I'm going to slow it down here a little bit. It does detect the 50 kilometers uh, an hour line. It does do a real full stop, <laughs> there's no quick stop, that's good. So there's something a little bit weird here about uh, the road that we're going to get ahead. Uh, let's see how it handles it. Pretty confidently, at least. Uh, it is a very wide road. Sometimes the, the Vestibida, like doesn't know what to do with those wide roads. Like, is it two lanes? Is it one lane? It's actually pretty much one lane here and people park on the side. This close to, to disengaging it, but whoa, look at it. That's good. You, you could you could feel that the FSD Sodak that that vehicle didn't know why they move forward so much so fast. But. All right, now we're gonna have a left turn here at a four-way stop. on it, it's breaking very far from the oh. I'm gonna put some gas in here for some pressing on the pillow because it didn't take its uh so technically that was an intervention because it, it wasn't it wasn't taking its place here oh and then we have a close road here is it detecting it it's trying to go right around it oh. <laughs> Okay, that was not good. I'm gonna turn here. That was not good. All right, so little disengagement here at the four-way stop. I had to, well, not disengagement, but uh, driver intervention. I had to press on the accelerator to tell it to like it's it's your turn to go because it, it it slowed down a, a lot earlier. And then it was I, I don't think it was gonna run through the the barrier there, but um, it uh, it definitely was going. Uh, too fast and like uh, it looks like it was about to like swerve around it or something which I'm pretty sure I was not allowed to do but uh, yeah so I guess it's a fail for our first try of uh, FSD beta 10.69 thank you for watching <laughs>